and welcome back to my channel. So, now my voice sounds really weird though, it's stupid. As you can tell from the title of this video, that what basically happened was I dyed my hair pink a little while ago, maybe like a month ago now, and I wanted it gone. I just, I just don't want it pink anymore. Um, because all the colours seem to be fading quite slow. So I decided to um, bleach bath my hair. <laughs> Obviously I'm not a professional, I'm not a professional in the slightest. Um, also sorry if you can hear any noise, background noise, that is my windows are wide open. And I've got my fan going. It's so hot. As you can tell I haven't some bowing hence the tan. Um, but yeah I decided to bleach bath it out and I need my roots redoing anyway. So, I made a bit of a mistake bleach bathing, I probably used too strong. <laughs> As I was doing it, what happened was my hair started falling out, especially here, you, you'll, you'll see it. So, can you see how short that is? Basically, what was happening, um, I spent a lot of time Googling this, obviously, is I bleached it and it felt very dry and brittle. It wasn't falling out or nothing, it just felt very dry. So I got a haircut, I got it thinned out a little bit, and that's it, I didn't have any length removed. And I bombarded my hair with, I bombarded it basically with um, moisture products, which is what you, you think you do sort of thing. And yeah, it was, it was a good idea. So applying too much moisture in your hair, you'll pull it. I don't know if you say, you might be able to see. Much. And it just it just comes out. So that apparently means there's too much moisture in it because apparently with bleaching it takes away all the protein. So I have a feeling I don't have any protein in my hair. So what I have bought is the Apogee. Apogee? Apogee, I don't know how you pronounce it, I will say it. Um, two step hair treatment. So this will put protein and balanced moisture moisturizer balancing balancing moisturizer in um to get your hair back to its regular ph this this is basically a cheap version of o opalex opalex i don't know how to say that either i i don't know how to say anything excuse me i'm in my pajamas as well um yeah i'm gonna give it a go it's a very chill relaxed video because no me it's just gonna screw up even more so I wash my hair, it's basically towel dry, I can hear I can hear as I go from my hair that bits just wanna come out. So I've washed it with just shampoo because I've been, I I have been so scared of washing my hair that I'm getting it wet and it's getting moisture so I've not really enjoyed it. So apparently you put this in your hair, um, and then you put it through. Oh, it's dripping over. What it does, it connects to all the bits that need bonding, apparently. I might need a towel on my table. There we go. So I want to focus it in certain bits. Quite sticky, this is sticky. What it's gonna do, apparently it hardens. And then you wash it out once it's hard. So I think it only takes like 10 minutes to harden. It's gonna take long. It smells weird. It smells very weird. So you can you can see little bits, little bits are coming up. not really instructions on the bottle. What there is Oh yeah you can put it on hard. Mm. 
pa siya ang mga Pfizer siya. Oh. So, yeah, like, I had to watch this girl. Her name's, um, if you don't want to follow her, her name's Nami. I'm gonna post her channel up there. And, um, she done it. Because she, she bleaches her hair a lot as well. And, um, this is horrible. This is well sticky. So yeah, I watched her video to see how to do this. And it worked very well for her. So you leave this in until it goes hard, and then when it's hard, you wash it out. Um, so apparently there's enough in here to do a few blows, which is good. Um, yeah, so I'm going to leave this in for like 10 minutes. Or until it's hard. Um, and then you wash it out. And then you put this second one in which is the moisture pH in for two minutes and then wash out again um so it was it was terrible every time i washed my hair like as it was drying the ends felt so dry and rough and horrible and then certain patches felt kind of elasticated sort of thing if you, if you get what i mean um yeah it's, you can go through my bins and see all the hair that I've pulled out as I said, pretty much just cut it there um, so hopefully this fixes it, I wish I'd find out done it, so I had the moisturiser in for 2 minutes I think it was and well it looks, my hair like now is dryish it feels healthier, it looks a little bit healthier especially like the bits that were fried the most, which is that bit and that bit. How can they have done right? Um, but I could do what I do, I don't use heat on it or anything. Which is a shame, because look how much longer that bit is. I'm not gonna lie, I'm quite pissed it off. I want extensions to help my hair grow. So I might get the clippings, so I might look, see who does clipping extensions. He's in clippings that I'm taping. And, um, just to try and give my hair a chance. To be honest. Um, yeah. I expected a better result because it's still not really like Still like that. If anyone has any advice or any tips, please please do tell.